General Hospital's John J. York shares an uplifting cancer update. Hello everyone, welcome back to my another video, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up John J. York is in good spirits. That may not be what folks would expect for the General Hospital star who was diagnosed with MDS, myelodysplastic syndromes, and multiple smoldering myeloma back in December. But Max's longtime portrayer is taking his cancer diagnosis in stride. When York sat down to talk with people, he put it this way. It's gonna work out oak, one way or another. In the end, it's in God's hands. I'm either gonna survive or I'm not and life goes on and things are gonna be okay for everybody. It helps, of course, that health issues are nothing new to him. The actor explained that he's dealt with ulcerative colitis and Crohn's disease since he was a teenager. This, he noted, was just another thing that I got now take care of. In fact, it was because of those conditions that he had to have constant checkups and monitoring, which helped the doctors find his blood disorders. With that said, it still came as a surprise, especially to his wife, Vicky, who, York shared, was understandably a mess. She cut right to the chase when the doctor started explaining what was going on, and flat out asked if all those medical terms meant her husband had cancer. He did. The word is enough to frighten anyone. But that hasn't stopped Vicky from being York's guiding force, the family caretaker, and an undeniable source of strength. It helps, as York told people, that I feel great. I mean, I walk three miles a day and I'm in great shape. And my diet is great and my appetite is great. The doctor said that was because we got it early. While he announced that he'd be taking a break from General Hospital for a few months, Max Portrayer explained to people that he should be able to fly back and forth between Tennessee and Los Angeles to film until his transplant. At that point, he'll have to stay home in semi-isolation. York's been getting IV chemo treatments every month since March at home in Tennessee. The really excited news, though he told Good Morning America, is that there may finally be a match. I believe they found a match. He shared, perfect match, which will make me cry. There's still some testing to do, but he should receive the transplant in November. Check out his full interview below. After that, though, expect Mac right back on our screens where he belongs. As he shared with fans when he made the announcement, he'll be back. In the meantime, we'll all continue to keep him and his family in our thoughts and have no doubt he'll beat this and be stronger than ever. Take a look at our photo gallery of the storylines tackled by soap operas that helped raise awareness and make a real difference in folks' lives. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, General Hospital Update, and stay with us.